Coach, just talk about the end of the season and coming into the tournament and your uh, kind of a preview for the tournament. Well, the end of the season didn't go like we had planned, <laughs> um, unfortunately. Um, so we are really looking forward to going into the MAC tournament. Um, we realize it's going to be a tough tournament, and you know what we're focusing on is just take it one game, one inning, one pitch at a time. I think. Uh, even though Emma Johnson was uh, all max second team this year, she was the pitcher of the year a year ago. Talk about her coming into this tournament, maybe some unfinished business for her. Absolutely unfinished business for her. Um, I felt like, you know, she, she had a good year, um, and you know, her numbers may not have been as good as what they have been in last year in, in terms of the uh, domination that she had but part of that was you know we didn't win as many games and, and our offense didn't support her all the time so she d is very focused and very hungry and you know not only Emma but we have a freshman pitcher Ronnie Ladinas who is just as good so we are really set I think with the pitching staff and in and, and I know the last time that we won the MAC tournament we had two very 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 good pitchers and um, we're going to ride them both and it is a pitching tournament, so that'll work out. And then just talk about your first round, ma your first round matchup. You're against OU. See Johnson versus Dorsey, most likely. Mm -hmm. Just talk about the Bobcats going here. Well, they, you know they they they're a very explosive team offensively, so they ha you know have a lot of good bats. So I think Emma has been able to contain them in the past, and and I know that uh, this is a repeat of a game that we played in the, our last MAC tournament. Um, so our kids are really focused and, and really looking forward to the challenge.